Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We have here with us today Matilda Thomas, who will be sharing with us her experiences with the quantum pendant. Matilda, can you tell us something about your health problem? Um, I actually have uh, two health problems in the sense that I, um, I had very bad metabolism rate as, um, or being overweight and things like that. And second one, I didn't have uh, my period for 13 months. Okay, let's look at your first problem. Mm. When you say you did not have good uh, metabolic rates, do you mean that your metabolic rate was low? Yes. So, as a result of your metabolic rate being low, what were some of the things you were experiencing? One, you say, is like, so you've got a tendency to be a bit overweight. Yes. Okay. Um, um, so, what else were the other like side effects of having a low metabolic rate? Uh, you feel so lethargic. Um, you're not able to actually focus and things like that. You're, you tend to be, you're sort of like, I think, mood swings in a sense when you're having metal, you're not working very well. You're, you've got no energy and things like that. So basically you find like uh, the, the, your whole approach to life is a bit more difficult because everything's a bit more tiring, yes. you've got to put in more, more energy effort. and more, more effort, effort. Yes. To, to get through a day. Yes, alright. Okay, now um, I understand you began using the quantum pendant last year, November 2006. Six. When you started using the pendant, what? Why did you start using? What was your? What did you hope to gain from uh, using the pendant? Uh, just for well-being, uh, well-being. Yeah. Because um, my sister introduced this to me, mm -hmm. so it was more of a well-being that would be healthy for me. But I didn't expect it to actually help me in that areas that I'm in. So when you say in that area, you're talking about your but low what, metabolic yes. rate. So how did it help you in that area? Um, I, I feel uh, more energy and things like that, and I and I finally, when you went to it with my, uh, with with the food intake and normal and things like that, I'm, I'm finding myself more energized. I can able to do things more okay. in a day. day. Yeah. But you you also saying that from November to March, yes. you also experienced you began to experience weight loss. Yes, I how, have. How much weight did you lose? It's this about uh, five to six kg. Five to six yes. kg. And did this involve like um, um, dietary changes at that point? Uh, not not much not not really not really I mean with my with, with the broad not really not, not really, at, yeah. at the point no so it's just basically by using the pendant yeah. you felt that you were beginning to lose weight yes and you also found that suddenly you had this little bit extra energy yes and there was less of inertia so you yes. could pack more things into the day yes. you were saying right. so what were the things that you began to pack into the day by right. March onwards <laughs> <laughs> like uh, from March onwards I. Uh, uh, I started like going to a gym. Then I started in April. Started going to gym, and I started even able to even. Uh, sorry, before before April going to the gym, I was able to even walk to work. Uh, walk to work and do walks, normal walks. Mm -hmm. But after since April, I started going to gym, mm -hmm. uh, doing the treadmill for one hour, and half an hour half an hour weights. So prior to March, how were you going to work? You said like before, like by March you were walking to work. Mm. So before that, how did you go to actually, work? Actually, uh, I have a bus service that goes to work. So usually I take bus, the bus because yes. you're just too tired to yes. to get to yeah. walk. Yeah. But you found that suddenly now you've got this extra energy and you could actually walk to work. Yes, and you enjoyed yeah. walking to yes. work. Yes, and um, my my breathing is much more back to normal. It's just that before that, before that, I can't even walk for for five or ten minutes. What happens after walking for five uh, minutes? We get so breathless and things like that. Yeah, because, yeah, I guess, mm. yeah. So you found that you had more energy, you could walk, yes. and you actually enjoyed it? Yes. Oh, that's amazing. And so you, you make a lot of friends on, along the way when you walk. So it's amazing, you actually find that you've got a whole, like, a new, new life change. Life change, a whole new approach to yes, life. Correct. You can pack in more into yes. the day. You've, so it's actually you're attributing all this to the pendant. Yes. The pendant gives gave you more energy, yeah. makes gives gives her more friends. Yes. And okay, so now from March, apart from uh, joining the gym, apart from walking to work, making more friends, what were some other changes that you began to that experience? That I, I I meet up with my friends more often now, more so, more often. I got with them more often, and we do a lot of walking and. And I'm even keeping power with them. 
and they were sometimes so surprised. How can you keep in power with me? So I just show them about the pendant and things like that. Okay. So from March to now, how much have you lost? Uh, about twenty something kg. That's a lot. That's a lot to lose. What do your friends say? They were they were shocked in a sense. They didn't believe me at first that is due to this, and I, I told them it's a fact because. I, I know the changes in my body, what's going on. Mm -hmm. And I tell them and say, oh, you're looking good. So I said, yeah, I feel good also. I say. So you feel good. How do you feel about yourself now? Uh, I feel so much alive. That's good. Uh, you're, at least you see yourself, there's, there's a future, and you know, it, that you can do more things in time to come and things like that. You know? So I, I told myself, two years time, I, I intend to go to KK to climb up the mountain. Wow. I'm aiming for that. Now once upon a time would you have ever seen no, yourself never. going up KK? No. No. Yeah, no, yeah. never. Yeah, so this is like you've adopted a whole new, new approach life. Yes. to life. Yes. And you're embracing life yes. totally. Yes, totally. Oh, that's that's really amazing. Okay, before uh, we go, I, you were also talking about how you did not have your period for about 13, 13 months. months. Yes. Yeah, um, that was, you were saying, from February 2006 to uh, February, February 2007. 2007. Yes. And you started using the pendant last year in November. November. And when you went to see, you said when you went to see the, your doctor, mm -hmm. what did he tell you? There was nothing wrong with me. They couldn't see any problem with, with me. So then you were not too worried about it? Or, yeah, okay. yeah. So I didn't go back to him yet. I, I didn't go back to him. So then what did you find? Then, uh, I really thank God that this came in in time, so uh, and this actually helped me in my health and things like that. So now you're having regular menstrual cycle yes, flow. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. That's very, that's that's good. Thank you, Matilda. Thank you. Now, Matilda's story is rather interesting. Most of us who use the pendant will find some physical changes happening. You know, physical changes that can be measured. In Matilda's case. Her whole approach to life changed just by embracing the quantum pendant. What Matilda found was, now she's been overweight ever since she's been a child. And when the pendant came to her last year in November, she found that without incorporating any dietary changes, she steadily began to lose five months in a period of November, December, December January, February, March, in a period of four months. Now, that gave Matilda that loss of 5 kilogram was just a stepping stone for Matilda. What it gave her was, it gave this young lady more energy. It gave her, that, five, that loss of 5 kilograms began to make her believe that she could pack in more into a day. She suddenly found she had energy to walk to work, something that she would not have been able to do prior to the pendant making into her, coming into her life. She found that instead of Taking the bus, she could walk to work. She found herself enrolling in a gym, something she would never have done once upon a time. She was on the treadmill for about one hour. She had, as, as she walked to work, she was making more friends. Matilda, her whole approach to life changed. Life was opening up and calling Matilda. All this because of the quantum pendant. The quantum pendant just gave her a little bit of an edge and with that edge, Matilda began to change her whole life. She signed up into an, a gym. She began to include dietary changes into her meals. She began to eat healthily, more fish, more vegetables, less red meat. Matilda now feels that she has got more going for her. She's got, uh, she's got more friends. And she looks forward to actually trekking up Mount Kina Balu in the near future. When do you plan to go up there? Two years. Two years. Two years that's, yeah. So she's got realistic deadlines. She's not pushing herself very fast, but with the pendant around your neck, you feel you're set to soar, right, Matilda? Yes, definitely. Yeah. All the best, Matilda. Thank you. Okay. Thank you.